good? Yeah. All right, we're live. Hello. Yes, the interviews keep on popping because the results keep on popping. So we need to show the stories because health is everything in life. Without health, you cannot be successful. That's the first step. You need to be healthy. A good house without health, it's 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 not gonna be. You're not gonna have a house. You need to have your health first. So. Special, another special guest. Everybody is so special, super special at the physique. But I need to tell, we need to tell the story. Antoine, thank you for coming. 21 Hi, years old and lost how many? 37 pounds. 37 pounds in three months. But we need to know your story because there is a story behind it. So tell us a little bit about your story. What happened to you? Um. I was born in New York, I moved down to Florida um, when I was two, lived there all my life, um, was homeless, I was in foster care, I didn't have any family, my dad, my mom wasn't around, um, but, you know, I still learned and tried to, you know, live my life as it was, I was down there, but it wasn't working, I wasn't working, I was, in, I was depressed, I tried to commit suicide four times. Guys, this is, this is a true story. Yeah. Um, um, I was adopted once for eight years. I was um, abused, neglected, but you know I still kept strong as, as much as I can. You know, as much as, much as I could. Um, but when I was 19, turning 20, I got in contact back with my uncle. Um, Who is your uncle? I'm sorry. My uncle is uh, uh, Dolan. Dolan Dolan Williams. Yeah. He's a wonderful, beautiful lighting bag around us. Dolan Williams is the coach here. Yeah, so, one, yes, one of the coach. many great coaches. Yeah. Um, so I got, in, I got in contact with him when I was, you know, in the midst of my tried suicides. Um, at first, I wasn't trying to move in with him, but, at, but after that, you know, after talking to him, getting to know him like I was supposed to know him for a long time now, um, I was finally able to come up here to New York, and um, I've been up here for three months, uh, I lost 37 pounds, I got a job in the first week I was here, and now I just got another job at Lima. So. Congratulations, so this is like a huge change yeah. for you. So do you think, because obviously you deal with the overweight, right? You're dealing with the weight. Do you think that all these issues, that it seems like it was difficult in childhood for you, you're so young, you're 21 years old. Do you think that this had almost like the impact on your eating habits, oh, do you think? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, depressed? Oh, you eat anything when you're depressed. Anything, everything, all things, all the time. I mean, I would I would go to the store and instead of buying maybe, you know, some like regular junk food, I would buy two bags of Sour Patch Kids, like three Gatorades, it was that bad. It was horrible. It sucked. I look back at it now like, what was I doing? But at that moment in time, I didn't care. You didn't care? You didn't know you were in the bubble of depression, right? But how do you like this now? Tell us more. How do you feel now? I feel proud. I feel energetic. I feel like I can conquer anything. Um, my want in life, uh, my next plan is to join the military, the U.S. Army. I want to join the Army by the end of the year, actually. Wow. I want to be enlisted by the end of the year. Guys, I do not know this. Story. We sound this for the first time. Yeah, so yeah. this is not stage. I do not know anything about this story. He's telling you as it is. Yeah, Tell us more. Um, I want to I wanna be able to give back to my uncle what he gave me, you know, because he was by himself. He didn't have to take me in. You know, he didn't have to bring me into his house. Into what, I, he didn't have to change for me, but he did. So I want to give that back. I want to be able to help him when, you know, whenever he's down. You know, he's never in. He's always working. He's always doing something. I want to be like that. And I want to be a mirror of, of what I see. Quick, too. Real quick. Really? So, what made you, like, really believe in you and you have a job, you're living with your mom, you still are, and you came to this gym, so what inspired you to start moving? Why? What happened here in the gym that helped you? What do you think it was? I 
think it was the camaraderie that I feel when I walk to the gym and everybody looks at you and they just smile. Everybody smiles. Nobody that's like down and sad. Everybody is there for one reason, that's to get better. That's I want to be a part of it. I want, I want to be in a place where I'm welcome. Beautiful story. And he went through so much, as you know. I mean, he shared, like, really deep, deep stuff with us here today. So, congratulate him. And I wish him not to block because luck doesn't come to us. We work for it. It's a hard work. And because he works so hard, it's going to come to him. And I see a change in him. I mean, we haven't spoken for a while right now. I mean, have you seen two weeks ago? I like, really, in the first month when you lost some weight, and I see the change, I see the sparkle in your eyes, I see the energy that you speak, how you really share your thoughts. It's a change, it's like 360, it's amazing. You're gonna accomplish whatever is there, whatever you have, whatever you create, whatever you don't have. Overall like, are you keep, keep on, he keeps on weighing himself on the scale. Yeah. He keeps on checking, he keeps on smiling, laughing. Tell me, what are you doing? Um, my goal right now is to lose 80 pounds, but my ultimate goal is to stay in the gym. I want to stay in the gym, I want to have wow. a gym life because I feel like you can't get to people anywhere else than you get to people in the gym. If you can see them when they're really, really, really trying out of their game. They're really trying to get to where they want to be. And that's what I want. I want to be in the gym. Wonderful. That's a great, great call. We wish you all the best. All the best. I am so happy. I'm thrilled. I feel the joy really coming through my skin right now because you are, you are 21 years old. And your story is so powerful. And I hope that some parents, some young men, women are watching and you are the inspiration for them. Because there's plenty of young kids out there like this. And yes, gym environment, in a good gym environment, like this physique is there for you. So come and buy, come for a session, right here in Nanuet or in South New York. We have two locations. Okay? And I go to both. That's right, you go to both. I go to both. Thank you so much for you for watching again. Everyone, thank you for coming. And no excuses, everybody. Bye-bye.